Hey yo yo yo! It's your uh, boy Mikey here, aka Ants Kamza. Um, and uh, just wanted to make a video because I haven't made a video for so long. Um, and of course that's because it's winter. Um, it happens to be Christmas Day, so Merry Christmas to all of you and uh, to everybody out there, no matter what you're celebrating, Happy Holidays. Um, hope you're having a safe, to a safe one. But uh, not a creature is stirring, not even some ants, especially here uh, in my home. Uh, I have been antless now for about two months uh, since, uh, you know, sticking all of my ants into the cool room in the basement. I keep all my ants um, <coughs> in my basement in a room that isn't connected to the centralized heating. So um, it's cold, but not that cold. Um, not as cold as it is outside anyway. Um, and that of course mimics the environment sous la terre, under the ground. Um, and uh, so I just wanted to create a video to show you what ants um, hibernating look like. Um, I check them maybe once every two weeks and haven't checked them for a while so I thought I'd take you to the basement uh, with me to check up on them. Here they are. Here we go. Here are the ants. I'm trying to get you a good view of her here. There she is. As you can see, she's still alive. And so are her two workers. Just a little slow moving though. There you go. Great work. Great work, Queen. Um, she is likely a formica. Um, Formica uh, subservicea. This here is uh, one of the Formica um, that I have. She's got five workers there. Wonderful, wonderful, and they're all still alive. There's her water portion. This is a. She's likely a Formica fusca. Um, and all these, of course, are wild caught from my area. I do abide by the by the laws. Here's a Lacius queen. Oops. It's likely a Lacius neoniger, or perhaps a Lacius alienus. One of the ones that I caught in one of my previous videos entitled uh, Catching and Tubing Queens. Let's see here. There's another Lacius Alienus. She's nice and full. Look at her. Got lots of eggs in there. She's got lots of eggs in there. She'll be laying those in the spring. Um, what else are here? Let's see, what's this? This, I believe, was a Myrmica. This was a Myrmica rubra, but once again, a failed attempt. She's dead, and she's begun to grow mold. Unfortunately, that happens. Um, okay, here's another Ponera that has managed to survive. Ponera Queen, she's still alive there, holding on for dear life, trying to make it through the winter. Good work. Let's see, one more. Let's see what this one here is. Uh, And this here is another chromatogaster 
clean. Still alive. And there you have it guys. Uh, those are my ants. Well, in particular, they are my uh, queen ants and starter colonies. Thank you for everybody who subscribed to my channel and have left off awesome comments um, and, you know, uh, all that sort of good stuff. Uh, be sure to subscribe if you haven't and you can follow up on some of the queens that I've um, got, you know, just ready to start colonies. I try to do my best to make great, fun and entertaining and quality videos for you uh, to enjoy and uh, as well as educational ones uh, so I can help you guys. Um, also, I know that a lot of people have asked me to create a video on how I make my grout nests and that I will definitely do um, in the upcoming year when I create some for my ants, especially those that are in the uh, are in the cold now and are just ready to start their own families. Really excited um, in the prospects of new ants to come. Thanks, guys. Much love. Happy holidays.